hello friends in this video i am going to explain about the how to decode the base 64 encoded string in pega in pega how can we decode the encoded string using one of the overtv function we can perform or we can achieve the decoding the base 64 encoded string for example uh, if you have any base 64 encoded string you can use it or else uh, uh, from the base 64 encode.org which is a website where we can get uh, a sample encoded string for example i am going to encode this string into a base 64 format so when i click on encode right when I click on encode JSON string, this JSON string, this JSON string is JSON string is converted into the base64 format. So I am going to take this one and uh, using the OOTB function, Pega has provided the OOTB function to decode that one. And before that, if you want, there is a website call it as a JWT.io. You can convert the or you can decode the encoded string. For example, here see automatically this is the encoded string this encoded string is converted by this jwt.io i mean to say the decoded this is the decoded string similarly how we can achieve this in pega in pega we have a function we have a function call it as a base 64 decode So we have a base 64 decode and you have to give the input as a encoded string and I am saving this one param dot decoded string click on save and if you want you can test it click on test See base 64 search. See we have a base 64 decode function. The input is encoded string. If you want, you can test it here. See this is the result. Name Suresh, email Suresh Tumati. That means uh, you have successfully converted or decoded this encoded string. Now click on submit and save. You can run. Click on run. Trace it if you want, you can trace it also. Click on run. Okay, here property set. Now, here you can see for the variables. Unfortunately, it is getting see this one. This is the decoded string and successfully converted later in Pega. We have the We have a data transform to deserialize. We have a data transform to deserialize This JSON string into a page. I have already uploaded my one of the video We can convert the JSON string into a Pega page page contains the properties and the values so you can use this json string to convert it into a page i have already uploaded one of my video please go through that but this function is useful to convert the encoded string into the this function is useful to convert the to encoded string into a decoded format later you can use this string to convert it into a page you can convert it into a page not only json format you can use any one of the you can use any one of the string for example i am using suresh encode you can use this one and you can decode this one you can use this one and you can decode it by using the base64 decode i hope you understand this video thank you